Hey, welcome back to some Thrive Knowledge here. Uh, not brought to you by Chipotle. Chipotle, if you want to not feel good, Chipotle. Also not brought to you by Zappos, a place where you go to buy shoes that you don't want to lose. And brought to you not by Airbnb. Is it safe to stay there? We don't know. Also not brought to you by the folks at Starbucks who say if you're willing to part with a buck and 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 a buck for a total of seven bucks for something to drink, come here. Venti. Venti. Hey, we're continuing our conversation in 5.12. Find the market's need and fill it in a memorable and differentiated way. True we're that. talking about uh, niches in the market, Clay. Niches in the market. Niches, niches in, in the, the market. <laughs> uh, we're going to take a look at a couple of brands that have found their niche in the market. Uh, first up is Chipotle, which you know doesn't always make you feel bad. I want to want to clarify that. Sure. Uh, this company was founded by Steve Ells who focused on providing the highest quality and completely organic ingredients he could find. He made the experience inside each Chipotle focused around simple, high-quality ingredients and simple industrial decor. Basically, his whole deal was he didn't focus on making the best-priced burritos in the world. He focused on making the best burritos in the world, in his opinion. 